The variation shader of Cinema 4D R18 has some new cool improvements compared to the former release R17. Um, it is now possible to load in as much texture slots as you like. So by clicking Add in your variation shader, you can add as much slots for loading in bitmaps or shaders as you wish. And we'll remove, of course, you can remove them. Um, the cool thing about that is that was only possible until R18 with the well-known MoGraph multi-shader. So um, this is now also implemented in the variation shader in combination with some other, some other cool improvements. So let's have a look at the detailed parameters. For each of the texture, texture slots you're adding, you can uh, define an individual probability, just as you know the probability as a global parameter of the variation shader. So let's choose some random values here. And uh, as you can see, all of them together wouldn't end up in 100%. So we have to find a way to distribute that in relation to 100%. And this is done by the Normalize Distribution button. If you click that, the relation of all of the texture slots to each other is preserved while guaranteeing that you end up with 100%. And if you want to distribute your textures evenly so that every texture gets the same probability um, of distribution, then you just click Distribute Evenly. What you also can do is you can add images directly by choosing a folder on your computer system, like this. With these additional texture slots, um, the legacy secondary texture slot should be left empty. You may remember that uh, with release 17 and the original release of the variation shader, we had this texture slot as second possibility of loading in a shader or a bitmap. Now with all those texture slots we have in the color variation section of our variation shader, that should be left empty. So um, this is about texture slots in the variation shader and we also have the possibility coming with R18, that UV coordinates get an improvement, um, meaning you can also scale as a variation. You can also use UVW scaling for variating your shaders.